Speaking of Sam Raimi touches, that, that helicopter chase scene, a couple cameos in there. Oh, yeah. Supposedly. This is a, it's, like a, it's like a double cameo because you get the, the Oldsmobile mm -hmm. that has been in every one of his films, even the ones that take place before cars were a thing. Supposedly it's in his Western According somewhere. To Bruce Campbell, he actually took the Oldsmobile and had a wagon built around it <laughs> for the, what was it, the quick and the dead. Can you imagine trying to propose that to a studio? <laughs> like, what is this in the, the, the budget? What is this? You're not doing this. That's so, the rumor. I don't know how much I believe that, just because Bruce Campbell is frequently intentionally full of shit to I, fuck with people. You know what, Jay? I'd choose to believe it, That's because fine. it's too fun. <laughs> the 1973 Delta 88 Oldsmobile Classic is in the picture. It's not seen in its original form. It had to really alter its appearance to fit into the Land of Oz. But part of its engine block and part of its, uh, I think it's camshaft, was used to play another role. Groovy. Part of the wizard's machinery. But in the, in the scene where the Oldsmobile has its contractually obligated Sam Raimi cameo, <laughs> it's being driven by the Coen brothers. That's what I've always heard. And so in rewatching it this time, I paused it. It's a really quick shot. It's just like a quick snap zoom. Yeah. It doesn't look like them. I recall from a commentary track, though, that it's the Coen brothers, but I think it's Bruce Campbell that said that. <laughs> so he could be full of shit. Okay. Uh, I, I, Sam Raimi's style is so specific, where it's like he gets shots and it has to be used very appropriately in the overall like editing of the sequence. Mm -hmm. So I guess the original editor had like a nervous breakdown trying to assemble all this bizarre footage and quit. So they got a new editor that kind of locked Sam Raimi out and they just did their own edit of the movie. And supposedly, this might be myth, I don't know if this is true, but supposedly Sam Raimi went in after there was a full edit by whoever that guy was and re-edited the movie back the way it was supposed to be. And the studio was like mad at him for doing it, but they were like, but the movie comes out in like five weeks. So I guess we got to release this version now. <laughs> I don't know if that's true. I'd like to believe it is. Uh, you know what? I also choose to believe that. That's yeah. I'll choose to believe that. And we'll choose to believe that the Oldsmobile is in Sam Raimi's Western. <laughs> <laughs> From director Sam Raimi, Dark Man. So yeah, that's Dark Man.